Welcome to Darwin, capital of the Northern Territory and a city whose name would be familiar to anyone that's heard of the Camp Fari, one of the toughest and most spectacular motorcycle endurance events in the country. From the running of the first race in 1972, word of the Camp Fari has spread nationally as both local and interstate competitors come to test their skills, determination and perhaps just a little luck against the challenges of the course. Not to mention there's also $10,000 worth of prize money up for grabs. I'm Alki Henry and welcome to Australian Trail Rider Magazine's exclusive coverage of the 2011 Precision Motorcycles 40th Anniversary of Camp Fari. location at the Precision Motorcycle Camp Fari for Australian Trail Rider. This race is for hard men only.
not to be outdone on toughness by the rest of the course, conditions at the finishing area slowly got worse over the four-hour race to become a treacherous and sticky stretch of mud as the riders ploughed through on each lap. Scattered with slippery ruts and almost invisible bog holes, it wreaked havoc on many of the competitors. It was also the scene for what is now the closest finish ever seen in the Campari's entire history when race leader Jai Willis' hopes of victory came unstuck. Finding a bog hole literally only metres from the finish and being passed by Brad Willis-Croft, who is only seconds behind him.